He might probably still look good, don't he? He put us back, cause we had fell off around 2001. Y'all wasn't there for that. But we back. And then he can, uh, <laughs> Hey, let me tell you. Hey, but he, he done maintained that same box, though. It went out, and I was back. <laughs> he done maintained it. You know what I mean? I've been thinking he'll break out a running man in any time, like... <laughs> like <for cheating. laughs> 95 was a good year. It's all good, though. Everybody going to church in the morning? What time y'all wake up go to church? You about to wake up about 11.30, try to get it by 12, 15. <laughs> Walk in right after announcements. Don't nobody really see me. They see you. They see you. Where the deacons at? The deacons here? Deacons in the house, don't want anybody deacons no more? Too much pressure at the deacons. They want me to be perfect, I ain't a pastor. I like women, I ain't. It's all been thinking. I'm a good sound man, what's going on sound man? You out here? They paying you? You ain't getting paid? See, that's why I go. If you ain't getting paid, you got hundred dollars, I'll be sounding perfect. Somebody pay this brother. I appreciate you. I appreciate you, my brother. You pretty cool too. What's that a curl? What you got up there? What's that a curl? You put something in that? Is that natural? <laughs> like you spray something in that? <laughs> what? <laughs> you know, hey, in black church, you know, you don't really have Baptist hymnals. You gotta know the words. But if you don't know the words, the deacon gonna tell you the words. But you gotta be ready. He gonna say, a charge to keep I have a God to glorify. Hey, charge. I didn't hear what he said. Say it again. But see, when I was a kid, I didn't know what he was saying. I thought he was saying Ray Charles. Bruce Lee is my dad. Have y'all ever heard that? Ray Charles, Bruce Lee is my dad. Ray Charles, Bruce Lee is my dad. It don't make sense, but it sound right. Don't call my mama. That's when you, see, Parents, you should be in the, it's so effective that somebody can tell your kid, I'm going to call your mama and everything stop. You see what I'm saying? Because that's why I opened up, but it's okay though, because I opened up a new business. I want everybody to sponsor me. You ready? I call it McWhippins. McWhippins. We got a commercial for it, McWhippins. What happened is, your kid acting up, I come over to your house, you sign a liability contract, pay me $100, I'm going to whip your kids, and I'm out the door. Because they need it. I promise you. So I'm gonna be a professional whipper. See, because the problem is, children are being whipped, but they're not being whipped like grandma used to whip. But you remember when grandma used to whip you? When she used to get you by the arm and you couldn't move? You remember that? See, she was telling you what you did while you was getting whipped. Y'all remember that? She was like, didn't I tell you about talking back and uh-uh, 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 but I found out sometimes that you was getting whooped for something you didn't even do. That ever happened to you? Uh, it happened to me all the time. Mom was come on, boy. Big acting up, talking back. Gas price is high. My boss talking. Get off. I said, Mom, I didn't even do that. Shut up talking back. I can't win. You ain't never had to use the bathroom like real bad, you feel me? <laughs> but you knew, but you knew in your heart that the toilet was like 12, 13 minutes away. So you went into your preparation, your, your preparation mode, your grip it mode where you holding it and you walking like this. <laughs> hey, come here, come here. Hold up, hold up. I gotta use the bathroom, bro. I'm probably not gonna make it. But you ain't driving, that's the problem. You ain't driving. So you gotta get, you, get me to the house, get me to the house, get me to the house. But they don't understand. So you reach your leg over there and hit the gas for them. Like, hey, hey. You got to go faster, you got to go faster. <laughs> Cause I might not make it. Lord, give me more strength. Lord, give me more help in your name right now to grip. Cause I'm almost there. Get to the house and roll up the car. Oh Lord, have mercy. Then you still walking like this. Oh Lord, have mercy. Hit the bathroom. Then you come out and act like nothing happened. Oh, yeah, it's all good in there, bro. Just get a few minutes. Let it ride, bro. Everything good. I can't stop no play. I'm getting old. I've been trying to dance. Don't you hate it? When you dance and in your heart you feel like you did it, but then you watch the video and you didn't. <laughs> that happened to me the other day. I did the snake. We came up on this. I went from here and I was moving too. All this, the elbow locked, everything. Hit this, came back, right? Caught the video next, I said, <laughs> What? What happened? 
I felt, I felt like I had it, but I'm just getting old. I ain't worried about it. And then being a man, you know, we the protectors of the house. What a man that the protectors of the house. Where y'all at? All right, all right, that solid rock. Yes, sir. Have you ever tried to protect your family when you were scared yourself? Yeah. <laughs> That's when you call on the name of Jesus. You must admit. The other night, my wife, my wife, you know, we lay down. All of a sudden, I heard in the kitchen, boom. She said, Mike. I said, Dorothy. <laughs> She said, what you gonna do? I said, I don't know what we should do. <laughs> <laughs> you need to check it out. Let's go, we gonna do it. <laughs> so I'm going in my house. I'm in my own hallway with the lights out. All I had to do was turn on the light. But see, I've seen so many movies, I wanted to be in the movie. <laughs> so I got my little nine millimeter up. I got it. And I done did this. <laughs> in my own house. Just cut on the light. All I had to do was cut on the light. I went in and the air conditioner just came on. That's all it was. But bro, I was looking good. I wish I could have seen you. Yeah, I mean, I'm just saying, if you're going to be an independent black woman, let's do it. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Don't choose when you're going to be independent black woman. Black woman. Don't choose when you're going to be hard. You hard out here. But hey, let's, you know, let's fight together. Do, fellas, you agree? You want to run everything up? Here's something else I learned today. Did you know this, fellas, this education for, about a woman? You know how uh, a woman, see, when you get married, you join bank accounts. Do you know when a woman spends your money, she don't feel like she spent your money? Yeah. But this is reality. This is reality. Wife comes home. Wife comes home. I'm like, hey, hey baby, I was uh, I was looking at the account. $300. How did it, what, what happened? How did it happen? $300. She's like, listen, this is great. <laughs> it was marked 700 I got it for 300 I saved us $400. <laughs> what? <laughs> I saved the $400, baby. We're going to take it to the top. This is really going on, fellas. Ladies, y'all laughing because you know what's real. Quit being hustled, fellas. Stand up. Don't spend my 300 You spent $300. You ain't saved $400. You spent $300. let us get it right. <laughs> And y'all quit hustling us. Got, got us. got us out in public looking sad. You ever seen a married man at Walmart? Walking with his wife at Walmart? I, I, I'm sorry, but don't laugh. You ain't got to laugh. You don't want to, but I feel you, bro. You walking, walking next to her, and she picks Every time she picks something, just deflates you. Like, oh. You gonna get that too, huh? We already got one. Whatever. I'm saving 85 cents. No, you spending a dollar fifty. Y'all understand. If you ain't if you ain't married, don't you know. And what's up with teenagers? Y'all ain't gotta laugh. I'm just gonna tell the truth. Teenagers, dog, they takers. They takers. They don't even do nothing. What do they do? They don't, they don't work. Ain't pay one bill. Ain't put 15 cent on the power bill. But they eat the most food. Can't tell them nothing. Always talking back. And here's what made me bad about teenagers. When they get mad at you, they want to embarrass you in public. You ever seen that with a teenager? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say something outrageous like, you were never there. What? <laughs> you live with me. Boy, get in there and sit out <laughs> you, ain't pay, you, ain't, you ain't paid for the toothpaste you're using. Give me $2 on the toothpaste, son. <laughs> teenagers, man.